Well, the future of medicine is here with the growing demand of greater access to health care. One local health care system is taking virtual care to the next level. And News 10 anchor Megan Kelly has more on the growing telemedicine program in a story you'll see only on 10. Seeing your doctor through a robot, that's the reality at the Cardiovascular Institute of the South. We don't have a physical presence in some of these rural hospitals. We have a virtual, so we have a, uh, ro a robot essentially, almost like a, like FaceTime, except it, it has some other technology where we can actually do a physical exam through the internet. The CIS Virtual Care Center provides care 24-7. Its hub is in Lafayette, but they provide services all over Acadiana. According to medical director Dr. Sibby Ayalor, Physicians can call in, speak with a cardiologist about a concerning case, and the cardiologist can speak directly to the patient through the robot. You can listen to their heartbeat, and you can listen to their heart sounds. You can see a nurse actually press to see if they have swelling in their legs. These robots are especially helpful for rural hospitals who may not have access to a cardiologist on site. Emergency Department Medical Director at St. Martin Hospital, Dr. Blaine Laverne, says it cuts down on travel time between different hospitals. So when we have patients that come to the emergency room and they're not a black and white, like not obviously a heart attack that we ship off right away or obviously something that's not heart related, we have a large percentage that fall in that gray area. So it allows us immediate access to a specialty that otherwise you wouldn't have at smaller hospitals. Currently, CIS has telemedicine services in about seven hospitals. They get about 20 to 50 calls a week. Dr. Ayalor says they hope to further expand the program as word gets out. In Lafayette, Megan Kelly, KLFY, News 10. Now, we will have more on the telemedicine program at St. Martin Hospital in the next couple of weeks. 